When you pair a song with the right visuals, the result can be truly astounding. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 best music videos of the year so far. For this list, we'll be looking at the most unique, impressive, creative, and rewatchable music videos of 2020 released up until now. The catchiness and appeal of the songs will inevitably play a factor in the ranking, but our central focus is the video. If songs were released in 2019 but the videos only came out in 2020, they will still be considered. We'll be excluding visual albums, although they definitely deserve their own all-time list. Number 10. John Redcorn, Sir It's been said that imitation is the most sincere form of flattery, but what Sir does with this music video goes way beyond homage or parody. John Redcorn is animated in the style of King of the Hill, and casts Sir and a few other familiar faces in the roles of the show's characters. Baby, diving deeper and deeper. She don't believe in case you don't recognize them, Boomhauer, Hank, Dale, and Bill have been replaced by J-Rock, Kendrick Lamar, and Schoolboy Q, respectively. Sir plays the part of John Redcorn, revisiting an alternate version of the character's long-running affair with Nancy, identified as Nisi in the video. Though only a little over three minutes long, the music video makes a full episode's worth of emotional impact. Number 9. The Box, Roddy Rich. Barely into his 20s, Roddy Rich has already made his mark on hip hop. The 2020's The Box saw the young star claim the number one spot on the Billboard Hot 100 for the first time in his career, and the song remained there for an impressive 11 weeks. Given the track's colossal success, it deserved similarly epic visuals. The video begins with Rich living out the ultimate Fast and the Furious fantasy, complete with a victory. The action then moves to a basketball court, where Rich again takes home a big win. Throughout the video, we're treated to a wide variety of scenes inspired by the lyrics of the song. I got the, mojo deals, we been like the, the unifying theme, Roddy Rich is thriving in every environment, finding success wherever he goes. Number 8. No Glory in the West, Orville Peck this unconventional and mysterious country music star seemingly came out of nowhere, but with the release of his critically acclaimed 2019 album Pony, he quickly found massive success, all the while refusing to confirm his actual identity. No, there ain't no glory in the West. Hard to think on your feet. Orville Peck can keep his secrets, just so long as he continues to deliver more great music, accompanied by beautiful music videos such as this one. Riding past the best, and there's still no rest. No Glory in the West is a thoroughly lonely little narrative that sees the star riding across an unforgiving and desolate but undeniably stunning winter landscape. Burning on the head, blazing through it, running blind again. What exactly it is that he's looking for is unclear, but the journey he's on certainly fits the title. It's a simple video made up of beautiful little moments. Number 7. Level of Concern, 21 Pilots Who says you can't do great things during quarantine? Just look at what OK Go were able to make for All Together Now. So there are Twenty One Pilots similarly never misses an opportunity to pair their unique genre-bending style of music with evocative visuals. I told you a level of concern, but you walk by like you never heard. 
Though the production value might not be quite as high as their other recent offerings, Level of Concern is all the more charming for its DIY elements. The video finds Josh and Tyler performing the super catchy quarantine anthem from home with the help of their respective partners. Switching between grainy video and more high quality footage, it works as a music video, a making of, and an adorable glimpse into the personal lives of the band members. Number 6. Watermelon Sugar – Harry Styles Released during the pandemic, Watermelon Sugar begins with a dedication to touching. And boy, is there ever a lot of it going on. Tastes like strawberries on a summer evening And it sounds just like a song Styles begins the song on a beach by himself, teasing the viewers with a slice of watermelon. When he finally takes a bite, the floodgates of sensuality are thrown wide open, as Styles finds himself joined by over a dozen women. Watermelon sugar high, watermelon sugar high, watermelon sugar. Sexually charged imagery is commonplace in music videos these days, but watermelon sugar is cut from a different cloth. It's like strawberries on a summer evening. And it sounds just like a song. Much like the outfits worn by Styles and the women, the entire video has a very vintage, nostalgic quality to it. This feels more like a bacchanal, a celebration of the senses like they used to enjoy in ancient Rome. Number 5. Cardigan – Taylor Swift The pandemic may have caused musicians around the world to cancel tours, but if there's a silver lining, it's that many of them use the quarantine to produce new music in record time. Sequence smile Black lipstick, sensual politics. Released just 11 months after Lover, Folklore is a return to Taylor Swift's earlier sound, albeit elevated by her growing maturity as an artist. Cardigan was released as the lead single, and the music video is a perfect summary of the album's dreamy, imagination-driven tone and themes of love. And when I felt like I was an old cardigan under someone's bed. I was your favorite. After sitting down at a piano in a small cottage, Swift's character is carried away to various surreal environments by the magical instrument. As fans have pointed out, the video contains a number of Easter eggs relating to her life and the rest of the album. You put me on and said I was your favorite. Number 4. Rain On Me – Lady Gaga and Ariana Grande Can we just appreciate how epic it is to have these two powerful artists on a track together? They both consistently deliver show-stopping music videos, and this combined effort, directed by Robert Rodriguez, does not disappoint. Coming down on me, water like misery. Gaga opens the video in one of her trademark elaborate and edgy costumes, and she's broad enough to share with Ariana and the backup dancers. Baby. In a throwback to classic pop music videos, the focus is on a group dance routine. What makes this video so thematically and visually interesting, however, is the mirror image that's being set up. Gaga and Ariana seem to simultaneously exist in parallel realities, and halfway through, Gaga dons the latter's ponytail while Ariana lets her hair down. It's just a lot of fun. Number 3. Godzilla – Eminem featuring Juice WRLD Bottle up, alcohol in a, feel like Godzilla, better hit the deck like Zakartilla. My whole squad's in here walking around the party, a cross between a zombie apocalypse and Bibabita. Despite making very different types of hip-hop, these two artists had the greatest respect for one another. ADHD hydroxy cut, past the kabasi. Hey. In AA with an AK melee, finna set it like a play date, better vacate, retreat like a vacay mayday. It would have been amazing to see them come together to shoot this music video, a legend in the making sharing the screen with one of rap's goats. You get in my way, I'm gonna feed you to the monster. I'm normal during the day, but at night turn to a monster. Sadly, following Juice World's tragic passing, Eminem was left to star in the video alone, but he still made sure to pay tribute to the young rapper who delivered him this kaiju-sized chorus. Not only is the video dedicated to Juice World, 
world, but the late rapper's albums can also be seen floating in the air. Cause I'm about to set trip, vacation plans, I'm on point like my index is, so all you will ever get is. From start to finish, Godzilla is a visually chaotic music video, jam-packed with references and sight gags. In short, it feels like classic Shady up to his old tricks. Number 2. Life is Good, Future featuring Drake in 2020, Drake's given us a few great videos. I'ma show you how to get it, it go right foot up, left foot slide. Tusi Slide saw Drake taking us on a masked tour of his home. It was understated but undeniably compelling, especially the dance moves. But Life is Good, which pairs Drake with frequent collaborator Future, is both artists at their best. Did what I had to and did what I did. Never turn my back on FBG, God forbid. Virgil got the paddock on my ribs, doing front flips. Two songs and two music videos for the price of one, it follows the hip hop icons as they work a variety of everyday jobs as garbage men, fast food employees, and mechanics. I'm on a PJ line, it up, back wood from the sticky boot. I'm trying to tote that Drake or London, and it's extended. It's a simple concept, but strangely captivating. There's even a quick cameo from 21 Savage. I think we need to change the lens. Yeah, yeah, change it up. We need a 35 mil. 35 mil, please. What do you want to do? Give you want again? One. Yeah, one more time. You're the boss. Before we unveil our favorite music video of the year so far, here are a few honorable mentions. Me in 20 years, Moses Sumney. I Know the End, Phoebe Bridgers. It's a golden drone, an alien spaceship either way. Wow, Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion. Tie me up like I'm surprised, that's role play. I wear the skies, I want you to park that Big Mac truck right in this little garage. Hard to forget, Sam Hunt. But I got no proof that you showed up tonight in that dress just a mess with my head. Break My Heart, Dua Lipa. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Blinding Lights, The Weekend. With After Hours, The Weeknd elevated his visual identity to a whole new level. In case you missed it, we actually did a deep dive into the Snow Child music video, an animated retrospective of the artist's career. In Your Eyes is similarly excellent. Our top spot, however, goes to Blinding Lights. truly cinematic clip, it's the heart of the musical journey that The Weeknd is taking us on with the music videos for this album. I can see clearly when you're It's kind of reminiscent of Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas, but sexy, gleeful, and with more of a glossy finish. Weekend, who is an avid cinephile, fully commits to the performance, and the end result is a music video that we keep coming back to for repeat viewings. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Watch Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.